The day we departed from the middle of Hungary, my name is Carl Rosell. I am 10 years old. My mom said you can only bring three toys, so I brought action figures. Me and my mom rode a horse to the shore. When we got there, we gave our horse away. I got nervous what was going to happen next. The journey over the sea was weird. It was like we lived there. My family was even weirder. They got, just got lunch, then they slept all day and night. I was bored. I did meet new people. They were helpful. His name was Josh. The waves were big. I thought we were going to sink, but we didn't. The day we arrived, we saw this big thing that my mom said was the Statue of Liberty. I did not believe her. We were still on the ship when we saw the Statue of Liberty. When the boat stopped at the deck, it took us two hours to get off the ship. When we got off, we went into this place that my mom always wanted to see. It was called Ellis Island. The first thing we did at Ellis Island was waiting in this waiting room. It was huge. Ellis Island was the biggest place I've ever seen. It took so long, I just would look at the Statue of Liberty. My mom said, you can go in it. Then all I thought was it would look like from the top. After that, we finally got called up to talk. I thought we were not doing anything else, but I was wrong. They pulled us up and just talked to us. I thought it wasn't so bad, but Grandma thought it was bad. I didn't think there was anything else after that. My mom kept talking to that guy. Grandma reminded me that we're going to see Dad. I haven't seen Dad in seven years. That guy talked to us and brought us back to a doctor. The doctor examined us. It was scary. Grandma had to see a different doctor. They took my hand and put a thing on my hand. It was kind of stang. It kind of stang. They had this chalk mark. If you got one, you went back. Me and my mom didn't get one, but Grandma did. It was sad. She had to go back home. After seeing the doctor, we went and looked at the Statue of Liberty. I asked my mom if you can go in it. Go in it now. My mom said no. This guy welcomed us and showed us around. I looked around at the cool stuff following my mom and I saw this really cool big thing and I really wanted to go in it. My mom said we will have to find a house. That one guy left and tried to help us find a house. My mom stopped and talked to me. Someone tapped me. It was Dad. We had dinner and moved into his house. The dinner was really good, and I had a couple pancakes, and it was very fancy.